Tropic Monster. Yes, sir. You're obviously a musician. Yes. You're obviously somebody who is uh, interested in other other musicians. In terms of defining your career, in terms of defining where you come from as a musician, who would you say your Tupac Shakur. Tupac Shakur. Yeah, my my music. I just start my music career. I start from Tupac Shakur. Uh, when he died in '96, uh, and somebody showed me like the Molesta crew from Poland. They did the first. Uh, a rap CD uh, album in Polish language, so uh, I was think, I was thinking only Tupac Shakur can speaking lyrics, <laughs> uh, rapping and stuff, but in Polish language you can do the same. And here I am, here I go, boom, Tupac Monster. But like, like you see, this Tupac is my I'm biggest fan of Tupac. Ah, uh, that's why I'm here on the music market. So in terms of style, I'm well, white version of Tupac. <laughs> So would you say that you modeled your style in terms of your lyrics? And I became from, from, from rap, from violence. But right now I'm so f flexible musician. I do blues, jazz, uh, hip hop, dubstep, uh, whatever, rock, uh, uh, rhyme style, everything, anything you want. Uh, just rhythm change, but music is music for me. So in terms of that upbringing, in terms of that lifestyle, would you say that's what kind of like catapulted you into fighting? Or that's got nothing to do with it at all? Just a second, please. You know your lifestyle, you yeah. said that you've grown up in yeah. violence. Yeah. Is that what actually made you train? Before I was rapper, fighting? right now I'm artist. Uh, I can't say I'm G right now. Uh, I don't kidnapping people, not raping rapists. I'm not gonna rape rapists and kidnap kidnappers uh, because before that was my uh, uh, my visit card. But right now I wanna say uh, I love you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Just sticking with the music, yeah. albeit momentarily. When you're actually um, preparing for a fight. What are you actually listening to in the gym? Is it more of your own music? You're working stuff out, or is it popular artists? I don't. I don't take music to the gym uh, because I need to put the music out from my head. Because I'm artist, I can't think about music. Listen music. I need, I, I need to listen the punches. Uh, you know the the voice of of the ring, but not the music. I don't control the music. I don't want to listen music when I'm training. Silence and just that's the music for me for my ears. So let's just imagine, you know, Puppet Monster was actually stranded on the desert island. Yeah. We're going to do desert island this yeah. with Puppet Monster. Yeah. What are the five defining tracks that you will have to have with you? Whatever uh, is remaining on your um, your uh, your iPad or your MP3 player memory in terms of um, uh, battery life as well. Yeah. So you have five tracks and five tracks only that you can take with you. What five, are those five so, tracks. So uh, two or three of them are going to be from Tupac. <laughs> uh, I think only Tupac. If I'm gonna take five tracks from anything, that's Tupac Shakur. I don't listen uh, different artists than Tupac Shakur. If I listen music, I listen my music or Tupac Shakur and nobody else. You know what's the intriguing thing for me, just closing down this interview? Why do you fight? You're such a popular artist. Why do you fight? Because somebody inside me, my my second personality, because I'm musician, artist and fighter as well, because I stopped fighting eight years ago. But this motherfucker wake up and he wants to fight, uh, so he, <laughs> that's the one. I got a couple personalities and one of them is the fighter uh, who, wanna, who wanna say, uh, I wanna fuck you up in the cage. Respect. Yeah. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you.